a national record. I mean, we have three big robberies, Michigan State, Hop, and Notre uh, Dame. <coughs> so, I mean, it's unfortunate it's come to an end, and this is the last time we play them at home, but uh, I'm excited for it. So, let's go. Taylor. Um, we're going to just talk a lot about the penalties you got when you were engaged with a lineman downfield. Did you think that should be a penalty? <laughs> I don't think anything should ever be a penalty when I'm being penalized, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, I mean, you know, calls made, uh, we came back and still scored, so uh, you know, I won't do that on Saturday. You can't have that. You know, you need a guy down the field, whether it's five or six yards, just block it. So, I'm trying to do my job, I actually did a little too well. And a uh, follow up on the running backs. Uh, obviously, you guys put a lot of the guys that we paired down this week. Um, I know that you don't really care who runs behind you. No. But for this team, do you think that you know you have a greater sense, or guys have a greater sense of their roles after one week? Yeah, I mean, I I don't know. So sense of roles. I know Fitz is gonna be you know, starter. I don't know if Fitz is a great running back. I don't know if Fitz does a great job, played a great camp, played well on Saturday. But he's gonna hopefully play better this Saturday. What do you remember about the Notre Dame game two years ago here under the lights for the first time? <clears throat> what I remember about it? You won. It was exciting. So it was a good game. Um, that came down to the wire. And you know, we never wanted to come down to the wire. But uh, at the end of the day, we won. So that was good. Last year, like I did, six turnovers didn't play well. Uh, none of us. So that's unfortunate. But uh, hopefully, we won't have this this year. You mentioned that you made some mistakes on Saturday, but they won't happen again this Saturday. How important is it for you guys to have that game before the, the Notre Dame game to kind of work out some of those kinks? It's uh, very important. Yes, I have a question. Um, <coughs> big, Shane got in there for almost a full quarter, maybe even a little bit more than that. How much do you think that will help? I mean, you go back to when you first played and you have one game on your belt, how much does it help to have one game if you're needed for the next game? Uh, it's, you know, it's good. You're always going to have nerves. So uh, it was good for Shane to get out there. First college experience, being just a freshman, that's huge. Um, I mean, you, when he you, gets in the game, he's expected to play the Michigan quarterback. So. Taylor, what did you make of Brady's comments in May about Notre Dame chickening out of this rivalry, and then Brian Kelly's comments yesterday about essentially dissing this is a historic yeah. rivalry for Notre Dame. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how to say about that. It's, you know, I'm playing football on Saturday. My coach can say what he wants. Coach Kelly can say what he wants. Yeah. Aaron Gardner can say what he wants. I'm playing ball. So it doesn't matter. Kelly, you mentioned your memories of the last game here was that you won, but I mean, Pretty much every game you've played in your career against Notre Dame has been, it's been close, it's been exciting, you find something to remember. When you're done and you look back, what personally do you miss about this about this series and this one? I mean, you, not now, but when you're done and you're, you're done. Uh, you know, it's, it's a huge national rivalry. I mean, to, to be around that team and play that team and kind of, you know, just the, the idea of a rivalry and like being there on Saturday and just the feeling, it's, just, it's, a, it's a phenomenal feeling. And uh, we have three big rivals. Uh, now it's coming down to two. Uh, fortunately, I played my senior year. That's huge, but uh, I don't know. it's unfortunate, but I'm going to get over it. <laughs> so it's all good. <laughs> Beck Bro on your left. Um, just talk a little bit about kind of the, the dress rehearsal against Central Michigan and then the huge step that you take into the, to the um, national limelight with game day here and on Saturday against Notre Dame. How dramatic the shift is. And just if you can already sense kind of an energy change. Uh, energy change. I don't know. It's, I don't know how much of an energy change. There's a lot of distractions that I don't need to deal with, that this team doesn't need to deal with. It's awesome having college game day be here. You know, national television, that's awesome. But uh, this is for I'm for football. And I don't care who I'm playing against. At the end of the day, I'm, you know, I have a job on Saturday to do. And uh, whether it's, you know, Stephon Tua from Notre Dame, or uh, Central Central Michigan doesn't you know I'm here to play ball so and all that stuff out the window I have a job.